hello and welcome to the channel if you haven't done so already make sure to like and subscribe now you guys thought that we had it bad right the dealerships asking 20 Thirty thousand for a Civic Type R. The GR Corollas dealerships or Toyota dealerships are asking twenty, ten thousand dollars, ten to twenty thousand dollars over MSRP for said vehicles. Now the Porsche dealerships, my God, they just said, "Here you go, buddy. Hold my beer. Let me show you how the markup game works." Now it's not just um, the Porsche that's doing it. I think Audi is also asking ridiculous amount of money for their vehicles too and i'm assuming that all luxury brands are asking premium i have seen the uh, mercedes-benz eqs dealerships asking almost double of the price of the of said vehicle but anyway let's go ahead and check out this porsche california <laughs> good old sunshine state california porsche dealerships asking a two hundred and fifty thousand markup on a 911 sport classic insane here's another one too dealer asks 375 for 25 mile used c8 corvette z06 insane these people are out of their fucking mind man but there's always that one sucker that's willing to pay the god price excuse my language so here we go <clears throat> Suggested price, 288000 and market value, $250,000. So you're looking at $538,000. That is a lot of moolah. I mean, the price of the car is already, you know, obviously. But that 911, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> it looks really nice. If I had the means, uh, I would not be paying half a million for it, but I will gladly pay MSRP for it. But let me let me look around real quick. Let me do a little bit of research and seeing if I can find one for a lower price. But even just that, that is just egregious. You don't get no accessories. You get literally nothing with the said vehicles. Nothing from the dealerships as options or nothing like that. You're just getting the car and you're giving the dealer an extra 250 grand for absolutely nothing this is getting out of hand i've been saying this a long time ago and thank god the market is getting to a point where <laughs> it can't can't do it anymore i mean look at the used car market for example look at carvana look at carmax they're struggling to move said vehicles so if the used car market is struggling guess what new car market will have to balance out. Everything has to balance out at the end of the day. And it, but, and what comes down must go up, and what's up there must come down eventually. And we're almost there. I just, I'm just asking you guys to just stay put, wait it out. If you're interested in buying a new car, shop around. Um, I think that, especially if you're into EVs or whatever, just shop around. Um, I think the EV craze has passed, so now you can get whatever you want. Even Tesla has lowered their prices because they want you to qualify for those incentives. <clears throat> but let me do that research. I, I got, all right, y'all, after doing a little bit of research, just a little bit, I've only checked two sites though, but I'm sure it all will be the same also. So the two sites that I checked out is autotrader and cars.com. Now there's only three in the whole United States and that is all the miles. So that's crazy. There's only three of them. There's one in, what is this? I think it's Manhattan, so that's in New York. And then this one is in Jacksonville, which is Florida, Jacksonville. So maybe you can get them for that price, um, but this one right here is absolutely egregious, but there's only three examples of this car in the whole United States, so maybe that's why they're able to ask this price. Um, but we have seen that multiple times. Anytime there's a limited edition of any said any said car, it's going to go for a ridiculous amount of money. But that's just how it is. The market is the way the market is. We have seen countless of Corvettes going for a ridiculous amount of money. Um, dealerships asking a lot of money for said vehicles. But, you know, eventually when the market does even out, all these people that paid these crazy prices for the 
for the cars. They're going to pay. <laughs> and I cannot wait until that happens. Until then, as always, make sure to like, subscribe if you enjoy the content. And I will see you guys in the next one. All right?